is doing well. Today I decided to show our new nighttime routine and how we're prepping for the new school year. Of course I had to start off with some coffee because it's actually not quite the evening. I wanted to record a little bit of some of the cleaning that I wanted to get done before the kids started school. everyone being ready for fall i'm so curious to know if everyone still prefers iced coffee or are there people out there craving hot coffee like i am right now i still prefer iced coffee if i'm going to starbucks but here lately in the mornings i've just been enjoying a fresh cup of hot coffee even though it's like 90 degrees outside but it just gets me that much more ready for fall I decided to pull out my planner because we had so much going on this week. Both kids just started back up with sports. On top of that, they're both going to school and they're actually going to two separate schools at that. And I just thought that writing everything down would help me plan out my week better. And I also wanted to make a list of things that I wanted to clean. That way I wouldn't leave anything out. So my goal for the day was to get rid of all old toys that the kids don't play with anymore. I wanted to get rid of clothes that no longer fit, that way it'll be easier for me when I'm picking out their outfits. I wanted to sweep and mop and wipe down both bathrooms. I wanted to clean the kids' rooms. I wanted everything to just feel super organized so that way I could start the next morning with a fresh start. My kids actually didn't start school till Tuesday, which kind of threw me off. I was really expecting them to go Monday, but I was excited that they got an extra day off. curious on if everybody has their fall decor up or is it just me i put up my stuff super early it was like the second weekend of august but i couldn't hold off any longer plus i have wanted to get up my decorating video um, before it got too late because i know most people do like to decorate for fall super early
Monday. So I did a bunch of cleaning yesterday. I went through all the kids' toys and I got rid of all the stuff they don't play with anymore and just the trash that I had piled up. I got rid of clothes um, from the kids and myself and we just put a bunch of stuff up. We did all this organizing to get ready for back to school yesterday. I wasn't able to record all of it, but if I could, it would have been a super long video because we got so much done. But anyways, it is the next day and Brayden had soccer practice today. So we just got back from that and the kids are super grouchy. They're literally whining right now. Um, so we're right now we're making dinner and then I'm gonna run the kids bath water and we are gonna get ready for back to school. cooking dinner. I got the kids clothes out for tomorrow. I'm so excited. They're going to look so cute on their first day of school. Um, I've also got to get a couple last minute things together for Mila. She needs blankets, um, a water bottle, and a change of clothes. So I'm going to go ahead and get all that stuff ready and then I'm going to help the kids bathe and hopefully dinner. We're going to make a big sound. We're going to break the mold. Something get it right. Gonna keep on running, grab the fun and live in life.
start packing lunches as well and we actually decided to not pack Mila's lunch. This is her first year in school. She's starting preschool and she eats just about anything and I really like the fact that she'll get the variety of the different foods at school. So we decided to not pack Mila's lunch but my son on the other hand is an extremely picky eater and he will not eat anything that the school serves. I don't know why it's super weird. So we just go ahead and pack his lunch because we just know that he will not eat lunch at all. Um, that's how stubborn he is. And then I also went ahead and packed my lunch. I was just prepping some veggies and some fruit for me to take to work. And then I also got distracted with having to make Mila dinner because she was super hungry. She requested taco salad, apples, and peanut butter. And it was just the weirdest combination, but she ate all of it. And she even ended up having a couple slices of pizza. kids had already had their baths and the only thing left to do was to get their hair brushed out for the next day and to get them in bed and I actually ended up reading them a book called Yes You Can that Mila actually got from her daycare worker before her last day of daycare just to help motivate her to start the new school year and I thought it would be cute to read it to both of them 
So after I got finished with her hair, that is what I did. And this is everything that we did to prep for the next day. And school went absolutely great for them. Their whole first week was great. And I'm just praying that all the kids out there have a great school year. And I hope that everybody stays safe. I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here forever?